What's going on guys? Kyle here with Jailbreak Central and today I'm going to be showing you guys how to increase the base or decrease the base on your MacBook Pro. Um, so this is going to be with iTunes, so actually anything with iTunes, doesn't matter, PC. And all you have to do is open up iTunes once you're in iTunes. Um, it's pretty simple. All you have to do is go to Window up here, scroll down until you see Equalizer, click on this. And this is basically what controls the amount of bass and treble in um, when you're playing a song. So now I'm. this is automatically set on flat. You can see everything is on the middle line here. Now let's say I wanted to increase the bass. I simply go to Bass Booster. If I click on that, you'll see these levels are increased, which basically means the bass is increased. Um, now you can mess around with these yourselves. You'll see if I click these and drag it up and down, um, it does go to manual. So I can actually make the bass, increase the bass even more. However, at a certain point, it starts to get, it starts to sound really bad and it will destroy your speakers if you do it too much. Um, now what you can do is, let's say that you like the bass booster, but you just want it a little bit more, like maybe like here. Um, I don't know if that makes a difference, but let's just say you want it there. What you can do is once you've done this, instead of um, setting this every single time and manually dragging the bars, you simply go up here and, and hit make preset, name the preset, um, I'm just going to say bass. And now, whenever I want to um, increase it, instead of just doing bass, oh, that's bass reducer, instead of just doing bass booster, I just click on the bass one, and then you'll see it adjusts it automatically. You can also edit the list and then delete the playlists, or not playlists, sorry. Um, you can delete the um, presets that you want, just hit delete, and then you're done. So that's pretty much it. Now you can do the same thing as well. You can opposite that. You can do bass reducer, as you can see there, if a song has too much bass, I don't know why, too much bass, whatever. But um, you can do a ton of different stuff. You'll see hip hop, kind of changes some funky stuff. Basically, you can uh, coordinate these to what type, what kind of song um, you're listening to. You'll see small speakers if you're playing just off of the MacBook Pro speakers. I would recommend this. Um, if you have... Uh, I don't know, just, you know, whatever, just mess around with these, see what sounds great um, to your playlists or your songs in your iTunes library. Other than that, guys, that is how to adjust the bass and treble on your MacBook Pro. And other than that, guys, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to leave a like, maybe share the video. It really means a lot, guys. Other than that, hope you guys have a great day, and as always, see you guys later.